What's up, y'all? It's I'm back. And uh definitely just got some crazy news that I already knew about. Um, I'm just letting y'all know the devil is really trying. He's really trying. And it's some something I just found out about some people that are close to me. And God is really removing people. God is allowing me to stumble and fall and make my own mistakes. But I'm telling y'all, like, devil, come on, bro. Like, you're not about to ruin me. I'm telling you, like, this thing that I just found out would have ruined me because I would have went off. I would have been ready to fight. I would have been ready to dis disconnect, Ty. Like, I'm making a disconnection, but it's it's from, from distractions. And I'm trying to get as close as I can to God. I'm telling y'all, if y'all are not fingers locked, holding on to his hand, you might as well walk away. But I'm telling you, the devil knows when you have such a purpose in your life, when you have such an anointing. I'm telling y'all, I'm so blessed. I'm not hungry for nothing. I'm I'm warm. Like, what I'm telling you, I have a job. I'm in school. I have the option to continue to go to school. I got a car. Like, I have all my necessities met. I have family. I have friends. Like, Actual friends. I don't care if it's just church family. That's all I need because I know they're praying for me. They want the best for me. And even all church folk ain't that, that way. But I'm telling you, I know some, some real saints. Some some people that really has have put time into knowing God and get it, like going through these trials. I'm telling you, right now is a trial for me. I just messed up. I felt uncomfortable about cuddling with somebody because I know my, my place is not in the bed with somebody right now when God's trying to be wants me to, to, to talk to him. I, I wanna I want this quick fix like like I can just go do anything because I wanna feel connected with people. But I'm telling you is connect connecting with God will fulfill all of that. I don't have to be laid up with nobody. I don't have to be kissing, touching, nothing. I don't have to be claiming no no titles required. None of that. Like what I'm telling you is God is is real. Like he is trying to show me there's something greater. And the enemy is definitely trying to hold me back. And I, I cannot let that happen. Anything that I've been tied to, if it don't, if it ain't about God, it's done. Turn it up like this, man. It's done. Like I don't, I don't need anything if it's not of God. If it's not from God, I don't want it. I'm telling you, friends. I don't care how close we've been. Bye. There's the door. Like I'm done. If it's it, my job, if they come talking crazy, tell me I can't worship God. I can't pray or something. I can't read His Word. I'm out of there too. I don't care. Like. If he made a way for me to get this job out of my place, he can make a way for me to get even more things. And even if I lose everything because of I'm making videos about me being honest, even if I if I lose like friends, like what I'm telling you is I serve the creator of this world and any anything and everything in it, like he can create opportunities for me to, to succeed, to go wherever I need to go. I'm telling y'all, bro. Like, I was just to the point of tears just before I did this video. I am okay. I will not allow the devil to win. Like, I'm telling y'all. Man. Man, it's gone. It's gone. Any inkling I had of homosexuality is gone. I don't have that desire. I don't care. It's uncomfortable. I hate it now. I hate it. I'm telling you because I love God and you cannot serve two masters. You don't have to decide. There's no gray area. There's no there's no gray. Oh my God, there's no gray. And I don't want to be in a gray area no more. Man, I'm so grateful that that I'm at a point where I can I can hear this and get this feedback and this negativity and be like, you know what? I want to go that much harder for God. I want to go there. I want to give him my all, my all, y'all. I'm talk, talking about full surrender. Full surrender. Right now, I'm on fire for him. Man, God, thank you right now for this revelation. Thank you for just, just breathing life through me, Lord. I pray that I am a light to your people, God. If it's not you, I don't want to be in it, God. I pray when they see me that they see you, God. Just everything. Just, Lord, take it. Take it all. Anything that is, that is in my way, Lord. Any distraction, Lord. Remove me from myself, God. I want to be, I want to be, I want to be seen as you, God. Like, I don't, I don't want anybody to see me anymore, God. If they are looking at me, I want them to see you. Like, I'm trying to tell y'all, it is pointless to be out here distracted. Who changed the price tags on everything that's valuable? Right now, all these materials, it don't mean nothing. You can't take it with you. Like, what I'm saying is stop. Just stop right now. Whatever it is, start again. Everything, let it go. Let it go, man.
Let it go and get in that word. Oh my God, let it go. What I'm telling you is I am letting it go. I'm letting it go, man. I'm letting it go. I'm letting people buy things, buy thoughts, negativity, this 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 self interest, this this lust, this flesh. Like, dude, I take it away. And what I'm telling you is everything ain't gonna change right now. But it's, it's already changed, but everything's not going to change for me tomorrow as far as how I feel, my flesh. I'm still going to, you know what I'm saying, mess up. But I'm telling you, today is the day I begin to die to myself daily. It's a daily thing. So tomorrow, I better say the same thing. The day after that, I have to say the same thing until it's time for me to, to go off to be with Christ. Like, it's about endurance, y'all. It's about endurance. Come on. Somebody needs to, to know, like, what I'm saying is it is never too late to start again. You can give your life to Christ right now. Confess with your mouth that he is Lord and he rose in three days. And he, he came to save you. Come on, before you were thought of. Come on. Like, it is time to quit playing church. Just because you're in the building, just because you got the Jesus speech, just because you got the Bible, just because you may know some scriptures. Come on. If, you, if he don't know you, he'll say, I never knew you. Depart from me. I'm not, I'm not about to be that person. I'm not about to be that one that played church and everybody thought everything was good. I'm telling y'all, I'm going to be humble. I mess up. I tell y'all, I'm going to persevere. I'm going to have to be more meek. Like, I'm going to have to be honest, truthful with myself. I am a mess, but he's cleaning me up every day. Man, I love y'all. Peace and blessings to you and yours. Man, God bless. And even if you make a mistake, he's the one that keeps you. He's the one that, that, that gives you strength and your weaknesses. And we are so weak. What I'm telling you. Man, I love y'all.